is following us. The distance between the earth and the moon is about 2,39 miles. The moon has a diameter of 2,160 miles. The large distance from the earth to the moon and the huge size of the moon both are reasons for the feeling that the moon follows us. You know that when we have traveling fast it seems that our surroundings are moving past us quickly. Naturally we think the case is the same with the moon. However, when we travel, the moon does not seem to recede. On the contrary, we feel it. It is following us. How does this happen? The distance between earth and moon is very great. The distance covered by the moon in a few minutes is far more than the covered by a vehicle thus while traveling an angle at which we see the moon doesn't change much even though we travel a long distance in the same direction the angle of vision remaining almost the same thus while the surroundings seem to recede the moon appears to follow us what protects europe from surf severe cold while rotating on its own axis the earth revolves around the sun as well because of this process sun rays fall directly at the equatorial region therefore the sea water in the region gets heated up the due to density difference in follows to the polar regions as at the same time the heavy cold water of the polar region flows towards the equator along the west sides of the ocean in low latitude the equatorial current towers poleward forming a farm current running parallel to the coast gulf stream also known as florida or caribbean stream is one among these warm ocean currents this water current touches the coast of Europe. The current meets the Labrador cold water current near the snow cart coast. Newfoundland falls on the Grand Banks of uh, Newfoundland are mostly caused by the advection from the movement of for warm, moist air over a cold ground surface. The Gulf Stream greatly influences the climate of Europe. The cold conditions of Europe result from the hot water brought by the Gulf Stream. Without it, Europe would have turned into an ice desert. Thus, the Gulf Stream saves Europe from severe cold. What is the color of the ocean? Actually, the water is colorless. But the several areas ocean appears deep blue. The reason in the scattering of sunlight as it uh, uh, penetrates the water. Sunlight is composed of different components colors. As light travels uh, through uh, water these colors are lost one by one. The blue color remains after scattering. The marine planets also gives a general color to the water. The Red Sea got its color from the red algae found abandoned in it. How does a spectrum tell us about the universe? It is through the study of the spectrum that an astronomer calculates the distance to the star, its temperature and its composition. The spectrum obtained when sunlight falls on a prism is composed of color bands and different lines this spectral lines are called four for a lines every element in its gaseous state has its specific spectrum of various lines when an element in 
heated to night temperature it lets out a spectrum made of its own particular lines these lines enable to is scientists to understand the elemental composition in a substance changes in temperature bring about changes in the spectrum of an element thus the temperature of a star can be determined with the help of its spectrum when a star approaches the earth the lines is the spectrum move towards the color violet when it faces away from the earth the lines tend to move towards red and therefore a spectrum tells you if a star approaches to recedes from the earth how do you get information about a star the star nearest to the earth is almost 41 per 2 digits years away and a light year is approximately 9.5 million kilometers in earlier times telescope was the only instrument is available to observe the sky but today scientists have invented several instruments for this purpose camera is the first of these with this one can take stationary photographs of stars another instrument is the uh, spectrograph this can take photographs of the spectrum of stars a star can have a spectrum similar to that of another also its spectrum has its specific colors and lines these colors range from blue to red the spectrum of a star reveals its temperature starts with a blue color are large very hot and bright their temperature amounts to 25000 degrees celsius star with which are red are cooled with surface temperature 1600 degrees celsius to collect data about the composition of stars scientists compare their spectra with spectrum produced in laboratories instruments like the telescope and radio telescope etc also help in the study of stars what is the structure of an atom about 2300 years ago the greek thinker uh, democritus um, devised the theory that all uh, things are made up of uh, very small practices he named this particles uh, atoms meaning that which cannot be divided the english word atoms is derived from this atom is the smallest fraction of an element that can take part is a chemical reaction atoms are made for the particles negatively uh, charged electrons uh, protons and nutrients there are called the primary elementary particles but in the hydrogen atom there is no neutron and difference among the various elements like gold silver and iron is related to the number of primary elementary particles in them the number of electrons or protons in in the atom will be equal the number of neutrons will be different it was j c thomson who discovered the electron in the atom and weight of electron is negligible in 1911 rutherford discovered that there is a nucleus in the center of atom electrons are rotating around the nucleus of atom in 1932 james chadwick discovered at atomic particle which has no electric change it was uh, the neutron does the night angel sing only at night Poets have written more about the nightingale than of any other bird. They say that this bird sings only at night, but this is not true. Nightingale is a migrating bird. It never visit Ireland, Wales, or Scotland, but it sings in places like Iran, Saudi Arabia, Ethiopia, Algeria, and Ghana. Only the male bird sings. It sings both at night and during day. 
However, we may not be able to distinguish its song in the day time from among the chorus of many birds. The male sings until his partner joins him. We hear he sings loud and clear at night since the other birds are silent. Who wrote the Bible? The Bible is the most popular book in the world. The book with the maximum numbers of copies ever printed is the Bible. The Bible has two parts, Old Testament and New Testament. But who wrote this and when? The Old Testament, the history of Israel, some old believes that rules of Jews are uh, dealt with. The story of Jesus is described in New Testament. Though put in a single framework, the Bible is really a collection of 64 books written by different people in different times. These books contain prayers, poetry, philosophy and history. We do not know who complied the book into one.